I've got something special in this video. It's special to me. No one else might even care about it at all. But it's special to me for one very particular reason. I'm somebody who's been interested in Bionicles since 2001. So when I think of those classic Bionicles, I often associate them with these right here. Classic style panel fairings, of which there are many different shapes and sizes. But unfortunately, they were discontinued in 2008, 2009, somewhere in there, in favor of the now modern style of panel fairings. There's way more of them, so I get it. They're still a cool piece, but I have an affinity for those classic Parts. So imagine my shock as I'm browsing through AliExpress trying to find content for the channel, because I do plan on doing some reviews of knockoffs here, when I come across this, and you might see it and say, oh, I see some panels on there, that's cool, but here's the thing, you don't, I mean, you do, there are definitely panels there, Lego never made those panels, and I don't mean in that color, I mean, that's not a Lego panel, they never made one in that size, and yet, here we are. A lime green panel, I assume a left and right version, you know I'm going to be getting this. I think I found this pretty consistently for like 7 or $8 on AliExpress, so come, you know, September 1st or whatever, I'll be buying it. I'd get it now if I could really justify spending 10 bucks, honestly, but I can't. However, if that's something you guys want to help with, Patreon link down in the description, 1, 3, and $5 tier, and that is all about this kind of stuff. Normally, I wouldn't go out of my way to do vehicle content specifically, because it's not really Bionicle, but it is kind of Bionicle adjacent, and this one is kind of candy for me, let's be honest. I'm not like a massive fan of Speed Champions or cars in general, but it is a cool looking build. It's got some specialized parts, but I 100% am getting it for those panels, and I think I can justify $7. So with that said, though, I want to make sure that the content that I'm doing on the channel as best I can is focused around Bionicle when it comes to knockoffs. So either Bionicle knockoffs themselves or Bionicle adjacent things, you know, uh, builds that have parts from Bionicle, from Hero Factory, from CCBS, etc. in new colors and new styles or completely new molds. This one, for example, has Hero Factory 1.0 feet in olive green, has these dark green Bionicle wings. It's $22. I'm not going to be spending that. You get the idea. And sometimes you are going to have to spend a little more to get more on AliExpress. I've found some really exceptional stuff and I cannot wait to showcase them on the channel, but you are the people that can help support that. So in essence, this is just a long roundabout Patreon plug. But again, that is down in the description. That said though, if you are interested in any of these sets or just learning about them, they are posted over on the Discord, also linked in the description. That's free. You don't need to be a patron for that. Um, and it's got its own channel. There's a knockoff channel in the Discord. You can go join like 750 people and check out that out because I think it's highly worth it. That's really everything I want to talk about in the video. Before I go, I just want to go ahead and showcase this because I was going to start the video talking about my proficiency in Rahi building. 200 Rahi is too many, but I've done it and I enjoy it. It really is the content I love the most, which is why I want these panels so much. It's really just nostalgia for me and I cannot express enough how I felt when I first saw them. It was almost as good as cracking open a Bionicle for the first time and seeing like a new mask in front of you. That's a very particular feeling, so hopefully you've experienced it. That said though, this little guy right here is a build that I designed. It's the Kakimara and it's fun because it is a uh, just an alternate model of one Nui Jaga. If you were someone who owns just one Nui Jaga, or maybe you own three and don't know what to do with the third one, you can build this. And it's cool because it bites and it also has a seat on the back of it with these pins here on the wings, I can't point to apparently, that can fit a McDonald's Matoran on there and the bite still functions even with the Matoran riding it. It's great. Highly recommend it. There's a video on it separately. That's going to be it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and hopefully you're having a great day. Be sure to subscribe and take care.